A stroke is an acute disease. What happens in the brain tissue is deprived of oxygen and other nutrients, and therefore the brain cells die, and this can cause disability. These patients might experience different symptoms due to the stroke depending on the affected area. Loss of function, speech, permanent disability, and even death. Unfortunately, about 85% of stroke patients are ineligible for the current standard of care, meaning that they have limited treatment options. Clinovel is focusing on arterial ischemic stroke. A clot is uh, lodged into an artery in the brain and it can kill the surrounding tissue almost immediately. And uh, it deprives a wider area of oxygen and nutrients and this area is known as the penumbra. So UV801 is the first study of clinical drug of amelanotide in ischemic stroke. So UV801 is what we call a pilot study. We administer the drug to a very small group of patients and we want to understand the effects. If we see positive results, we take the learnings from this study to design and run further clinical trials with more patients. In CUV801, we expect to treat up to six patients with aphamelanocyte following a stroke. All six patients will be treated at one specialist center. The primary objective of the study is safety. This is the first time aphamelanocyte is being used in stroke and therefore we need to ensure that the drug is well tolerated. We need to make sure that aphamelanocyte has a good safety profile in stroke patients so that the program can continue. So we are focusing on any adverse reactions that the patients may experience after receiving the drug in, in the study. In parallel, we are seeking to understand what effects the drug might have to improve the patient's condition. In a small group of patients, this is largely exploratory and we need to conduct larger studies to show efficacy, but it will help us to evolve our thinking towards the next steps of the program. We are using clinical imaging, CT scans and MRIs, and they will help us understand the extent of the damage caused by the stroke and the effects of the treatment on the penumbra. We are also using clinical evaluations to assess the extent of the patient's disability throughout the study. Overall, each patient uh, is going to be followed up for seven weeks, and once all the patients have been enrolled and completed, in the study, we will analyze all the data and we will determine the next steps.